Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to design a simple basketball in SOLIDWORKS. I hope you like it. Let's see how to do in SOLIDWORKS. Now let's start to create a basketball here. So first we will select front plane sketch. Go to sketch and here select circle and draw a circle. Okay. Choose center line and draw a center line and it must pass through origin. Exit. Now choose here trim entity, tr power trim and drag and delete. Okay, now let's define or define the mid distance. Keep the diameter 240 mm. Okay, just go to feature and here you will find revolver boss base. It is asking you the currently sketch is open so select no. And see here the axis of revolution selected and keep the thickness 2.5 mm okay now you can see the section view this is the full hollow ball okay now we will define some uh, or better let's define it some color go to plastic we will define a real look so select here pattern blue and drag it small that's it take little so it should look like a real view of okay now this pattern is uh, like a real basketball now let's we are going to cut make the path or make the cutouts in basketball so first uh, select top plane right plane go to reference geometry axis and we want to create an axis okay now this axis created now first we will create some path so choose here front plane sketch select here center line and draw a vertical center line and horizontal exit again choose center line up to the outer surface outer crust and define the angle 45 degree okay now choose here center point arc select any point from this point to here exit now select both the end points and midline and create relation symmetric okay choose here line and define a line from here to this point exit now select the arc and line and create relation tangent okay choose mirror entity select this line and mirror against this line okay choose here center point star point and put it on this line and let's define the distance 30 mm okay now select this arc and this is star point and make relation coincident okay now you can see here the geometry is fully defined it's no need to make more defined just exit go to feature and here you will find project curve now select the surface now you can see the preview a path preview okay now see a, a path is created better it's uh, difficult to visible so choose the normal color okay at the end we will decide the color this curve path is projected on this curve now we want to make one more pa path so do one thing front plane sketch normal 
and uh, let's draw the same way exit select three point arc or uh, better define center point let's keep the angle 45 degree okay now choose three center point arc exit now select both the end point and midline and define the relation symmetry choose here line and draw one and two end of the surface tangent relation okay now just mirror this line against this vertical line okay choose here center point put in this line exit and define the gap 30 mm okay now select the line and center point and make relation coincident okay now see the geometry is fully defined so simply exit and go to features and find out here the same procedure project curve now select the surface and but here select reverse projection we want reverse projection it sketches on faces okay now see but both arcs are different uh, not connected so first we need to connect it so select here composite curve both cu curve we want to connect so here select curve 1 and curve 2 entities to join okay now both the arcs joined now we want to create some cutouts here first cutout so let's start choose here front plane sketch normal go to sketch and select here center point straight slot this one center point straight slot okay choose smart dimension and keep the length 5 mm only and let's keep the 0.5 mm radius okay now select the center point and this arc and make relation pairs okay now select this arc and this line and make one more relation tangent okay now exit now find out here one option shift cut now see the profile is selected just select the path see it's going to cut go to option and here select twist along path okay now this one we will define some color so it black okay now we want to just uh, rotate or mirror choose circular pattern select this cut out here and select this axis here select 360 degree two numbers of pattern equal spacing okay select this pattern and define the same color black now see front plane is sketch normal choose here center line and draw two center lines exit again choose the same center point slot exit make sure it is vertical find the length 5 mm and radius 0.5 mm now let's define the distance
122.5 mm it should go from mid that's perfect okay and find out your revolved cut select this vertical line as axis okay now see we cut it cut it here let's define the same black color now we want to make multiple number of patterns so select here circular pattern select this cutout and choose here axis keep 90 degree only revolve cut clear the geometry and select only now it's better we selected here axis 90 degree and two number of patterns equal spacing okay now you can hide see now it's now our basketball is ready now it's time to define some uh, realistic material so i already shown it before Uh, let's make little less so it looks real look this better choose your orange okay now it looks real basketball Uh, if we want to define some logo here we can define so let's define some logo here select right plane plane and make the distance 130 mm okay now select this plane a sketch normal choose here center line define one approximate uh, length of line and choose here and select here adidas select here font bold keep 35 now after creating this letters just we will split the line we choose here split line command axis selected just select this face projection okay now hide this plane now you can see this projected on this we will define some high gloss plastic so the it looks better see now as you as the in the same procedure you can draw it here a logo i am going to skip this proce this procedure now i just skip this procedure to create this symbol but it's finished it's same as what you did in to sketch this adidas letter i hope you like it please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid works don't forget to share and like our videos i hope you enjoyed it looks real texture of adidas adidas basketball thanks for watching